What is going on, my lovely subscribers? My name is Buzzsaw. We're playing some Tony Ox Underground, and we are back with episode 10 of our Let's Play, playing the game from start to finish just for you guys. And I've wanted to do this for a long time, as many of you know. And we are almost done with the game, guys. I'm really excited. We are really close to finishing it. We're actually at the final stretch here. Not actually, we probably have about one to two episodes remaining. Probably one after this, I'm guessing. So, uh,. Right now, I want to inform you of what happened in the last episode. In the last episode, we were we got into Moscow, and we did some challenges, and we got blamed by Eric for the tank incident. If you want to see that episode, feel free to look in the description of this video for the previous episode, so you can get up to speed of what's happening in the game. But uh, we got blamed for a tank incident that was actually all of Eric's fault, and we're doing a goal with Joey right now, but... Uh, yeah, we got blamed for that, and we had to find our own way to escape Russia because our team left us because they didn't want to pay for the fines that we caused for the tank. So uh, we had to find our own way out, and we actually got help from Alexander and our Russian friends. And so here we are back in New Jersey doing some goals right where we started the very first level of the game, and we're back here, and uh feels really good. And we're almost done, as I said before. So enjoy the video, guys, and... Right now we're doing uh, a nail all the tricks. This is kind of similar to a mission that was in the beginning of the game, but uh, uh, it's a little bit harder. There's more tricks added and stuff since you've gotten newfound knowledge since the last time we did this mission. And so yeah, just gotta do. I I think we have, yeah we have one more trick left. So uh, let's just do this. Uh, I don't know why I was doing lip tricks the whole time. I, I wasn't paying attention. Uh, my bad about that. Okay, so uh, Mike V likes our idea of the skate video game together. The skaters that actually really care about skateboarding, not for the money, and... Not for the fame, just for skating, for fun. So uh, we have to pick a team right now. I'm going to pick Tony Hawk, Rodney Mullen, Chad Muska, Mike Valley, and Bam Margera. That looks like a good, solid team of my favorite skaters in the game. And uh, what name should we name this? Uh, I'm trying to figure that out here. Um, I don't know. Let's go. I have something. Let's go Buzzkill. With my, obviously, my capitalization stuff going on. I don't want burping so much. Crap. Alright, that looks pretty cool. Let's just do it. Heading back to Peralta's skate shop. We've been here many times throughout the game, as you may notice. Okay, we got a killer team. Now to spread the word. We're going to make a skate video. But we're not going to make some cookie cutter film where everybody is skating the same stuff. We're going to make something bigger and better, totally unexpected. Check this, dude. I've had this for years. I've been saving this list of secret spots since Animal Chin. Okay, so we got some secret spots that we need to hit. And we have to do these pro challenges for the video. And this should be really fun. And we're going to start off with the Hawaii Huge Spine Challenge, which is one of my favorites. It is one of the most difficult if you, uh, because you will struggle, You, I will most likely struggle on this, but uh, I'll show you what I mean in a second here. Uh, we have to think of which skater we want to use. Um, let's use Tony Hawk because he's talented in vert skating and uh, lots of air. Okay, that's the one that you have to be careful of because the first one's not a problem right here, as you saw. But uh, this second spine is really difficult because you don't really, you only get like a certain amount of uh, air that you have. Like you barely clear it from the first spine to the second. You barely clear it, and you just have to make sure your board is straight. And what am I doing? I'm trying to transfer. I'm trying to do the old goal. That was transferring between the hotels. All I have to do is spine transfer. I don't, I don't even know what I was doing there. So you have to gotta, you gotta make sure your board is straight when you're doing that second spine. And right there, I just did an acid drop, and I'm about to fall. Oh, okay, I'll just 
restart. Oh my god. Why do I... I such a bad habit. I, I keep trying to cha transfer. Alright. I can barely talk today. Um, Alright, we got number three. I'm gonna overshoot that if I... If I went for that, we're just going to take it nice and slow. Go number four. We got it. Finally. That was a little frustrating because I kept thinking I was trying to transfer between the hotels and stuff. So, uh, But, yeah, we're good. We're going to go with the Tampa THPS Challenge, which is Tony Hawk's Pro Skater Challenge. This is actually a really fun mission. Goal. Whatever you want to call it. We're going to pick uh, Muska for this. He's an all-around skater. It's pretty cool. All right, 10,000 points in five seconds. We could do this. Yeah, we got it by 11,670 points. And so you will notice by each round, you only have five seconds to complete it. But every round, it takes away something. Like right there, it just said no spine transfers or walking. This time, it says no revert spine transfers or walking. And it takes away a skill every time. And uh, actually, we're already on the last one. This one, an easy way of doing this is just heading in the pink garage and doing a combo off of this quarter pipe that you just saw me do a trick there. Because you can't really, I don't think you can grind or whatever, so that's the easiest way of doing it. That's a little tip for you guys. Alright, uh, I want to do slam a jamma, but uh, let's do the Vancouver Spine Transfer Challenge real quick. That's an easy one. That shouldn't be too much trouble, hopefully. Okay, I don't want to bust my collarbone, but I'm going to pick Mike V for this one. Alright, there's the first one. There's the second one. And the last one's right here. Pretty simple. Now scored 100,000 points of footage. Okay, just have to get a decent sized combo or get a string of tricks going. There's 21,000 points. The Mike V, bon uh, Mike v Boneless, I, I seriously can't talk today, I don't know why, but uh, Mike V Boneless is one of my favorite tricks, it looks so cool, the, it's basically only a 360 Boneless, but uh, it looks really cool, he makes it look really awesome. Right there, I just bailed, alright, I only need 4,000 points, and we got it right there with a nice spine transfer, I, d I actually didn't know there was another ramp on the other side, that uh, spine, so fortunate me. We're going to do Slamma Jamma and Vin's Slam City Jam, which is one of my favorites. It's really cool. You have like a certain number of combos and you have to trick on everything in the arena. Well, not everything, just where the green fist is indicating something like a grind or a ramp or something, as you see right here. So it says on the right top corner, you have 19 combos. So it's the best way to do this is definitely of keeping your combo. And just hitting as many as you can in one combo. Well, you don't actually have to hit it in one combo. Just make sure you're conserving your combos just in case. Because on sick, I, it gets really hard. And it gets really challenging. But right now, we just have... Right now, we have half of them already done. So we're in good shape. We have 18 left. We'll get this done with no problem. Alright. Ten more. Uh, for a second there, I was burning combos real quick. A little bit. Alright, seven more. Six more. Five more. Alright, let's grab this one over here. Alright, got that. And three more. And I already see them, so... We're good. Oh. Could have just gotten off my board, but... And we... Oh, wait. I'm missing one. Where is this last one? Oh, I missed it back there. I don't even know how that happened, but uh, there we go. We got it. Okay, what next? One more we have to do. Just We're going to do the Big Apple. This is a fun one, too. Just like Slam a Gem, you have to do some tricks over or collect the green fists all around the city. This is actually really fun. 
Look how many of them there are, but really, it's not that hard, actually. It's really fun. Last but not least, Rodney Mullen is going to finish up our video footage here. And there are 39 objects in New York right now. And we have six right now. Oh, I fell. I didn't mean to fall. I could have done that easily, but I fell. Alright. Right now we're in 78 Water Street. That place from the story mode. Well, in the beginning of the game. What the hell? How did I even end up there? I, I just launched up from the quarter pipe and land somehow landed in a uh, skyscraper or a little thing. Well, what do I call that? Uh, I don't even I don't even know. Sometimes you get so distracted when I'm playing the game, it's not even funny. All right, we need uh, 18 more. I thought I could just walk by that one to get it, but obviously I have to grind. And that truck almost cut me off. 14 more. 13 more. Missed one. We have 40, se 40 about 40 seconds left right now. Now we have 40. Alright, we're almost there. I remember these last ones to be on top of the big building where we hit that nut buster, so yeah, I was right. They're by this courtyard up here. And there they are, guys. And that is the Big Apple Challenge. And um, I'm actually going to cut it right here. I'm going to save. And so thank you guys for watching. And next time we are going to finish up the game. So hopefully you guys are going to be waiting for that. So please remember to rate the video if you enjoyed it. And I'm out. Peace.